What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Bobby the Goat and I'm back with another video. So today guys, I got a crazy story time to tell you guys. Crazy story time. But before we get to the story time, I need you to like, share, subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you get notified when I upload a video or when I go live. Follow me on my social media. But without further ado, let's get into the story time. So today guys, man. Story time be telling, uh, I was about 14, 15 when this happened, so around there. I was in this apartment complex called Highlands Apartments. Highlands Apartment. And uh, this particular day, you know, I, you know how you get up, you get that feeling like something's about to happen. So, I had one of those feelings. <laughs> I had one of those feelings that something's about to happen before the day even started. So, in his apartment complex, it's a uh, it's a park. It's an apartment complex. So each and every day, um, I'll go to the park. You know, meet up with people, play ball, whatnot. So I got up. I went to the park a little early. Was nobody there. So I went back home and. Um, Went back home for probably about a couple hours. About a couple hours, I went back home. Went back to the park. I got there probably about two, two and a half, two, yeah, about two. Something like that, about two, somewhere around there. So, people started showing up, playing ball, boom, boom, playing ball. And then, uh, so we started to, you know, wrap up ball game and just start walking through the neighborhood and around a certain time and around a certain time throughout the day police used to patrol the neighborhood because it's like break-ins and stuff like that so we was walking through one of the parts of the um of the neighborhood and uh the police was coming was coming in this way please come in this way we going this way so and in this this section of the neighborhood is three speed humps so when we was walking through you know police you know they stopped slow down because it was probably about eight eight of us nine of us maybe ten of us right you know pretty good decent sized group so we all um and we walk whatnot, slow down. Please slow down. They uh you know looked at us and whatnot. So he went over to the second speed hump where we met them at. So then they was going towards the third one, but they was going slow. So we kept walking. So somebody in the group, you know, they was, you know, that's mess with the police. In my head I'm like <laughs> No. <laughs> That's all on you? No. But, as they say, you know, don't be a follower. Be a leader. That particular day, I followed. <laughs> but, uh, so we all picked up rocks. Pretty good, decent sized rocks. We threw the rocks in the air, and boom. It's about to go back. The police, <laughs> it was two police officers in one car. One of the officers jumped out. Once I seen that, I'm gone. I mean, I'm booking it. So I ran back to the park. Some people came with me back to the park. Some people, you know, kept on going through the neighborhood. So the people that came with me um, behind one of the goals, it's like woods and stuff, like a trail. It's a trail inside the woods. So we went through this trail. And when we went through this trail, uh, we had came up to a road. Yeah, we came up to a road. Well, we came up, we came up to a, I guess say like a shed, I guess is what it was, like a shed. Um, so we came up and remind you that it rained the day before. So we came up to this shed through the, through the trail. And uh, so we made the right, the police, that was that hopped out the car he got back in because his 
his uh, partner told him to get back in. Cause he, I mean, he yelled it. So he got back in. They started chasing us, whatever. And they went down the same road that we was on because we seen them. So I, I ran. And I, when I, I, I ran. And I was about to make a, a left turn around the shed. I slipped and fell. So <laughs> when I slipped and fell, you know, the people that was behind me, the people that was, that was with me, they got up, they got me up, I brushed myself off. But then in my head, I'm like, yo, like, did you just trip me? Like, <laughs> I know you ain't just trip me though. Like, <laughs> why would you do that? <laughs> like, I'm not understanding this. So, you know, I brushed myself off, tried to get as much dirt off of me to make you know not notice that I was you know running from it whatever so we hide behind the shed next thing you know I hear the sound in the air and is the you know police helicopter so now they got eyes in the sky uh cops patrolling and we hear sirens from different ways so we ran back to the neighborhood so we ran back to the neighborhood down the street see the street you can go left or right we went to the right ran back to the neighborhood Running back to the neighborhood. So we just running through the neighborhood, running through the neighborhood, hide different spots. We see police cars, we hide behind cars, beside cars, you know, doing what we can, you know, so they won't really see us. But I mean, they still got eyes in the sky, though. But so we went to another neighborhood across the street from our neighborhood, from Holland's apartments. So uh, we went there, we went there. At this particular uh, neighborhood, it's a entrance. You can enter this way. You can exit this way. It's the same way up top. So we came from up top, and when we went there. Uh, it was an off-duty cop who was who was just not getting off. So we decided to you know talk to him whatnot to make it seem like you know everything is all cool. And uh, so we talking to him, you know, he, uh, something going on and, nah, 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 you know, just talking. And next thing you know, the same way that we came in, one police car came in that way. And two police car came from the, from the other entrance way. So, uh, they came, I guess they patrolled it. And the next thing you know, they all came and started talking to him. So they all looked at us. And they told us to sit down on the curb. By this time, they, they knew it was us. So they asking questions and whatnot. Um, and then what else happened? Oh, they asked questions and whatnot. And so then they, they let us go. So one of the guys that, you know, we, that, you know, was running with whatever, he stayed in the neighborhood. But he, he got to his house and left and went to the mall. Like he went straight to the house and you know, but I don't I don't think he I think he stayed at the park. I don't think he walked with us though. But um he went to the to the mall and whatnot because he went to his house. I think his somebody came to the door. I forgot who it was. Somebody came to the door it's like he had went to the mall. But um before like we even got to his door when I was sitting on the curb, you know, talk well when the officers was asking questions, stuff like that, I try to get up. And I will say, if you never had a Charlie horse before, I'm telling you right now, it's gonna be the worst pain. Worst pain ever. I mean, that's the worst pain ever. So I got up and I try to take a step and behind my left thigh. I caught a charlie horse immediately i dropped right back down to the ground i mean right back down so you know i'm ah uh, uh, you know i'm telling you, you know, the officers on my leg hurt and whatever he's like that's what you get for you know all that running you was doing cops but um <laughs> so then i i crawled a little bit then i got back up on my feet and started to um and started to try to, you know, 
make the pain go away, so it started going away, whatever. So I'm walking with a limp. And uh, I went back to the house from all of that. I went back to the house. And uh, I think we was, we was going to my aunt's house or whatnot. But moral of the story is, you know, if you ever get that feeling like something's about to happen, you know, like something bad's about to happen, do everything you can to make sure that does not happen. You know, you get that feeling like, oh, my day is about to whatever, whatever. Do everything you can to make sure your day turn out good. <laughs> But it's your boy Bobby the Goat, man. It's the end of the story time. Uh, like I said, like, share, subscribe. Hit that post notification bell. Follow me on my social media. And hope every day you have a... What? Hope everyone have a blessed day. I'm gone.